I'm really, really proud to present you a glimpse into the future of immersive human-machine interaction. Here you can find our AI woman named Ellen, your immersive mistral companion. What is Ellen all about? It is a safe and secure avatar you can talk to on-prem. Elam is a touchable generative AI communication asset, representing industry-specific knowledge in mixed reality. To get the hands-on immersive experience, we combine technology of our technology partners. At first, the immersive representation with our partner Hypervision. In the back, you have a high compute power from NVIDIA. And for the brain, we integrated the newest models of Mistral AI, so it's really, really easy to get an interaction with Alan. You can just tap and talk to her directly, or you can also choose to start the interaction, one of the pre-selected questions. Who is the head of Capgemini's business unit in Germany? Henrik Jungstrom leads Capgemini's business unit in Germany. So our approach with Alan is that we use different kind of AI models that she can listen to you, understand your question and answer it in a context-wise way. So what we are using are three different kind of AI models. We are using OpenAI's Whisper to transcribe um, the, the speech. We are using Mistral OpenAI's large language model um, to get a good answer. And we are using Azure Open Offline Containers to transcribe the text back to speech. So what really excites me about this project is that we decided to go on-prem with the whole solution. So we had a large language model on-prem, we have the speech-to-text on-prem and the text-to-speech on-prem. Also, the curated data we use from Capgemini to answer the questions in context-wise is working very, very well. And this was a challenge, but it was also an exciting trip for us. What we also learned while we were showcasing Alum that there are various use cases along the entire value chain. For example, a global premium OEM said that would be perfect to have that kind of technology representing in a brand storeroom. Somebody else from public said that would be amazing to answer the questions in the society in an urban context. And also somebody from medical said that would be great to talk to the patients in the hospitals. I think really that every industry along the value chain will get a benefit in the future out of that kind of avatars. Perhaps we have to see how big or how small and in what kind we will represent the information. But I think that human-machine interaction based on streams or immersive screens, that will be the future. It's been a pleasure conversing with you.